know guys, the expansion of the universe has not been slowing due to gravity, as everyone thought, but instead has been accelerating. This was highly unexpected and astronomers struggled to explain it. To account for this, it was proposed that a dark energy was responsible for pushing things apart more strongly than gravity pulled things together. So let's discuss about this topic in the video. But what is dark energy? The solution, it seems, might lie with another cosmic mystery, black holes. Black holes are commonly born when massive stars explode and die at the ends of their lives. The gravity and pressure in these violent explosions compresses vast amounts of material into a small space. For instance, a star about the same mass as our sun would be squashed into a space of just a few tens of kilometers. A black hole's gravitational pull is so strong that not even light can escape it, everything gets sucked in. At the center of the black hole is a place called a singularity, where matter is crushed into a point of infinite density. The problem is that singularities are a mathematical construct that should not exist. The black holes nestled at the centers of galaxies are much heftier than those born when stars die violently. These galactic supermassive black holes can weigh millions to billions of times the mass of our sun. All black holes increase in size by accumulating matter, by swallowing stars that get too close or by merging with other black holes. So we expect them to get bigger as the universe gets older. In the latest paper, the team looked at supermassive black holes in the centers of galaxies and found that these black holes gain mass over billions of years. The team compared observations of elliptical galaxies, which lack star formation, in the past and in the present day. These dead galaxies have used up all their fuel, so any increase in their black hole mass over this time cannot be ascribed to the normal processes by which black holes grow by accumulating matter. Instead, the team proposed that these black holes actually contain vacuum energy and that they are coupled to the expansion of the universe so that they increase in mass as the universe expands. This model neatly provides a possible origin for the dark energy in the universe. It also circumvents the mathematical problems that affect some studies of black holes because it avoids the need for a singularity at the center. The team also calculated how much of the dark energy in the universe could be attributed to this process of coupling. They concluded that it would be possible for black holes to provide the necessary amount of vacuum energy to account for all the dark energy that we measure in the universe today. This would not only explain the origin of dark energy in the universe, but would also make us radically rethink our understanding of black holes and their role in the cosmos. Much more work needs to be done to test and confirm this idea, both from observations of the sky and from theory. But we may at last be seeing a new way to solve the problem of dark energy. Thank you guys for watching my video. Please like, comment and share this video. Also support this channel by subscribing for more astronomy videos.